currently on my car tripod, which I usually don't use because it tends to fall. So if it falls and I lose you guys, that is why. But right now, guys, I'm stressed. I joined a gym. Well, actually, I was I was part of a gym like two pre pre panty, and I have not been since. And I'm having like gym anxiety, like stress. Like I'm stressed about it. And I've been a member of this gym now for one week. I have not shown up yet. Ugh, you guys like are not even straight, sitting straight. Whoa, okay, you just fell off. But basically, I'm on my way to the gym. I'm really Whoa, you guys are really falling. Okay, basically, that whole rant was just, just to tell you that I am stressed. And I feel like this is something that a lot of people go through because I was talking to my friends about it and they're like, yeah, honestly, I get stressed to go to the gym as well. So luckily, the gym that I'm going to has a women's only area so I can kind of dabble in the weights because that's what I want to do. Like, I want to build build my dump truck if you know what I'm saying and just feel strong so that is the plan today but I'm just documenting it to keep myself accountable and make sure that I actually go to the gym if you guys ever feel stressed about going to the gym like please comment down below so that I don't feel alone even though I know that like it's like a very normal thing because I want to go into the weight section and boys scare me and it's also so intimidating because like I don't know form I don't know anything to do so we are going to go to the gym conquer our fears and get 2022 started so that I can build my hot summer bod but all bodies are hot so don't worry okay I'm rambling see you at the gym okay we have made it to the gym I'm starting on the treadmill doing 12 3 30 but my AirPods actually had no charge in them and I felt uncomfortable just being at the gym without headphones so I pretended they were working and I went about my way. So after doing 20 minutes on the treadmill I just randomly started to do a cool down so I guess that was over and I went to go and stretch. Then I headed over to the weights area, picked up a 15, quite ambitious for my first time back in the gym in a while. And now I'm gonna start on some ab exercises. Please do not judge my form. I'm just a girl trying to figure this out. Then I moved on to some squats. I did a few variations and that was the workout. <sighs> my first gym session is done. It's done, and you know what? It was not that bad. I tra well, I tried to film some of my, some of my workout, um, as unsuccessful as that was, because like it's very intim intimidating when everybody's looking at you. I was in the women's only area, which like gave me a lot of peace of mind because walking to the women's area, I got whistled at. I was like, "Are you joking? I don't want to be whistled at at the gym. That's like my biggest fear." So now it is time to go home. Oh, I also spoke to a personal trainer there, a woman, and she was very insightful and she is going to give me one personal training session for free because I told her that I- ah, You guys fell again. Which way were we going? She's going to give me one personal training session for free because I told her that I don't know how to do anything and I don't know how to use the machines or- I'm just really intimidated. So she said she would help me, but guys, number one is down, many more to go. We are going to build this dump truck. One later hey besters i might look a little bit more tan and bronzed and that is because i fake tanned yesterday hershey is excited you can hear him crying in the background but yeah i'm a little bit tan um so i use the isle of paradise self tanning mist in dark guys it worked like i am so tan i look whoa that's not good lighting i look so bronze um the only thing i did mess up on is my wrists that's not good but you know i'll just throw on a bracelet and it'll be fine but i did get a package in the mail today and i don't know what it is so i thought we would unbox it together Okay, now you are balancing on a Bible. Hello, I'm not Christian. I hope this is not a sin. I bought this for a gym bag. So it is a like canvas bag. It has a zipper, which I really liked. And 
Here's the inside. Oh, it has pockets in here, cute. Um, and it's just this little bag that has daisies on it. And I thought this would be really adorable for a gym bag. And then I know every single video when I buy something, I'm like, I'm gonna use it in the summer on my vacation, my European vacation. But I also thought this would be a really cute beach bag. But now that I'm seeing it in person, here is it in comparison to my head. That's really small and it's not gonna fit a towel. But this still could be cute to walk around with. I am not mad at it, I'm so excited. Since I'm gonna use this as a gym bag, maybe I'll go to the gym today. We'll see. It is a little bit later, I ate, and I changed into a gym outfit. And um, guys, I realized that when I took my pants off, that I really am not good at fake tanning and half of my legs are not tanned. So only the front is and then the other half is not, but whatever. It is winter time and nobody's gonna be seeing my legs. And honestly, for the first time fake tanning, I didn't do horribly, but like I have a lot to learn for next time. I'm on the, my way to the gym right now. And last time that I spoke to you guys about going to the gym, I was really stressed. And to be honest, it doesn't get any easier going to the gym, like I'm still Really nervous but today I'm going to a class so the class should definitely help me be more comfortable and honestly that's the way that I like to work out when like someone else is telling me what to do because I don't really know how to work out by myself I don't know exercises I don't know reps I don't know anything so we're going to the class it should be good we're gonna get our sweat in summer is coming I need to get myself back in tip-top shape and honestly yesterday I also went to the gym yesterday I did a class it was a yoga class how are all these 50 year old ladies so fit like I genuinely don't understand like I am 23 I should be killing it these ladies have their legs over their heads and balance and they're so strong. Also, because I'm so afraid to go to the gym by myself and I know that like nobody really is like paying attention to me and it's really just all in my head, but um, I'm trying to get my friend Shelby, I'm calling you out in the vlog. <laughs> she watches all the vlogs, love you. But I'm trying to get her to come to the gym with me because working out with a friend is so much more fun. There is someone to keep you accountable and it's just better. Like I would feel so much more confident to go to the gym with my friend and like she could spot me and I could be doing weight things and using the squat racks. I want to be somebody who loves the gym and who's so comfortable in them and like I know what to do but it's just not the case and I see all the hot gym girls in their gym shark outfits and their set active outfits. They just look so good and so hot and I that's you know what that's my goal of 2022 to become a hot gym girl. I made it to the gym and I forgot to show you guys my new gym bag. I'm so excited. Um, I'm finally putting it to use. Honestly, it smells floral. I don't know how they did that. Um, there's people looking at me. That's the downside to vlogging. It's like super awkward because it just looks like I'm talking to myself all the time. But I'm not. I'm talking to my besties. Um, so yeah, I'm going to use my new gym bag. I'm so excited. Really, all that I bring to the gym is a lock for the lockers. Water earphones that's really all you need anyways gonna go to the gym also this gym has the worst parking it kind of makes me not even want to go in to be honest it's just an excuse that i'm telling myself to be like oh there's no parking you don't have to go to the gym it's not true you have to go to the gym and i'm putting on lip gloss to go to the gym honestly i can do so many things to avoid actually going in Hmm, that's pretty this is the nars um, lip balm lipstick that I showed you guys in the haul if you watch the Sephora haul video It's really good. And honestly the packaging is very aesthetic Okay, now I'm actually going to the gym. Goodbye A few moments later I am coming to you red-faced and sweaty guys. I did the dang thing. I worked out um, I didn't end up doing a class today because it just didn't work out with the timing so I went into the ladies only section that is my place because when I work out I don't want people looking at me I don't want men around me no men <laughs> but um yeah guys I did it and I was I was following a uh, workout plan that I found on Instagram and I looked over and the hot fit girl who was working out beside me was like doing the same workouts as me I don't know if that was just by coincidence or if my workouts were actually good 
But yeah, I left the gym. Honestly, I realized as I, as I was walking out of the gym that um, all of the cars, mostly like 95% of the cars were backed in. So I don't know, like, you know when you, you can like front in or back in, they were all backed in. So next time I go to the gym, all the men, I'm gonna assert my dominance and I'm going to back in my car to fit in. But, oh, also as I was working out, so the fake tan that I put on, you're supposed to put it on for like four to six hours and let it um, set and like get darker. I've had my on, mine on since last night, so it's three o'clock now. I've probably had it on for like 18 hours. I don't know if I like wanted to be a little bit bronze. I'm like just, I do everything to the extreme. Pop up the, the tan, but yeah, I was so scared that I was gonna like sweat off my tan. So that is like a new fear that I've unlocked that I'd never had to realize before. But yeah, I worked out. Guys, the gym is not a scary place. I know that it seems like it is and even I get intimidated, but you have to go. Like you have to conquer your fears and if you're too scared to go somewhere or do something, just do it. Do it and conquer it and don't let anything stop you from it being your best self and achieving everything that you want to achieve. I'm on my fitness journey to just feel stronger and uh, healthier really also I have to improve my diet but that's out the window I love pizza and ice cream and cookies and sushi is my number one but anyways thank you guys so much for watching this week's video I hope that I made it a little bit easier for you guys to work out because it's not just you like everybody is stressed to work out when you first start like you don't know what you're doing you don't know what form is right you don't know anything so put on your hot outfit feel good in the gym and just do it that's my motivational speech okay love you guys see you next week bye Mwah.